In a time where the cost of everyday essentials is rising fast, seniors across the U.S. are feeling the impact deeply. With monthly benefits often covering less than what's needed, the struggle to keep up with inflation has turned into a daily challenge. It's crucial for policymakers to recognize that an increase in benefits isn't just needed it's essential for supporting the dignity and well-being of our senior community. Today, we're discussing some important information about Social Security payments for November, including a few changes to the typical schedule and what you can expect as the end of the year approaches. Social Security serves as a lifeline for millions, with around 68 million Americans receiving benefits each month. That includes retirees, survivors of deceased workers, people with disabilities, those with limited resources, and more. Social Security's impact is profound. Roughly 9 out of every 10 people aged 65 and older receive some form of Social Security benefit, helping cover essential living costs. In fact, Social Security payments are estimated to make up about 30% of the income received by people over 65. For many, these benefits provide critical support to cover expenses like housing, food, transportation, and healthcare, especially as costs continue to rise. If you're wondering when your Social Security payment will arrive this month, let's go over the November payment schedule. When will I get my November Social Security payment? Your specific Social Security payment date depends on your birth date. Here's how the schedule works for November. If your birthday falls between the 1ST and 10TH of any month, your Social Security payment is scheduled for the second Wednesday, which will be November 13. If your birthday is between the 11TH and 20TH, you can expect your payment on the third Wednesday, which is November 20. For those born between the 21ST and the 31ST of any month, your payment date is the fourth Wednesday, November 27. This staggered schedule helps the Social Security Administration manage payments and ensures that everyone receives their benefits without delays. These dates are consistent each month, so you can plan ahead, knowing exactly when to expect your benefits. If you receive Supplemental Security Income, SSI, your payment follows a different schedule. Typically, SSI payments are sent on the first of each month. However, there's a small change this month, SSI recipients will actually receive two payments in November. The first is on November 1, as usual, and the second is scheduled for November 29. The reason for this early payment is that the regular SSI payment date for December falls on a Sunday, December 1. To ensure there are no delays, the Social Security Administration has moved the December payment up to the last business day of November. Additionally, if you're a dual beneficiary meaning you receive both Social Security and SSI you'll likely see your Social Security benefits arrive on the third of the month, as well as any SSI payments on the usual schedule. Since November 3 falls on a Sunday this year, those payments will instead be issued on Friday, November 1. What to do if you don't receive your payment? If you've checked the payment schedule and believe your Social Security payment is delayed, the Social Security Administration recommends waiting at least three mailing days before contacting them. In most cases, minor delays are due to processing times within individual banks, and waiting a few extra days can save you a phone call. If your payment still hasn't arrived after three days, you can reach out to the Social Security Administration for help. The SSA's national toll-free number is 1-800-772-1213, and representatives are available from 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. local time, Monday through Friday. If you're calling, try to reach out early in the morning or later in the week, as these times generally have the shortest wait times. You can also visit a local Social Security office for in-person assistance if that's more convenient for you. Social Security's Payment Schedule for 2024 and Beyond You can always find the official Social Security Payment Calendar on the SSA's website. The schedule usually follows the same general format, with payments issued based on your birth date. However, adjustments are occasionally made to accommodate holidays and weekends, as we're seeing with the two SSI payments this November. 
Planning for these schedule adjustments can be helpful as you manage your monthly budget. Looking ahead, the Social Security payment schedule for 2025 has also been posted online, so you can review next year's dates and prepare accordingly. How Social Security Payments Are Calculated Your Social Security Retirement Benefit Amount is based on your average indexed monthly earnings, AIME, which factors in your highest earning 35 years of work. The Social Security Administration applies a specific formula to your earnings history to determine your primary insurance amount, PIA, the base amount you're eligible to receive if you retire at full retirement age which is between 66 and 67 for most current workers. If you claim Social Security earlier, at age 62, you'll receive a reduced monthly benefit. However, if you wait until full retirement age or beyond, your monthly benefits increase. Waiting until age 70, the maximum age for deferral, allows you to receive the highest possible benefit. This delayed retirement credit is helpful for those who can afford to wait and want a higher monthly payment. Social security payments provide vital financial support, and for many, this income is essential for covering everyday expenses. The costs associated with retirement are significant. According to federal data from 2022, retired households spent an average of $54,975 per year. This includes costs for shelter, transportation, healthcare, and other necessities. As people live longer, the cost of retirement continues to rise, making Social Security an indispensable part of financial planning for older Americans. Although the 2.5% increase is more modest than some previous adjustments, it's intended to help protect the buying power of Social Security benefits as inflation continues. For an average retirement benefit of $1,873, this adjustment will add about $49 to the monthly payment, bringing it closer to $1,922. For many seniors and people with disabilities, every extra dollar helps when managing essential expenses. Creating a My Social Security Account If you want to stay updated on your benefits, check your payment status, or get help with Medicare, Disability, Retirement, or SSI, consider creating a My Social Security account at ssa.gov. This free, secure account lets you review your earnings history, calculate future benefits, and track payment dates all from the convenience of your home. You can also use your My Social Security account to update personal information, set up or change your direct deposit, and access important SSA documents. Thank you for joining us to learn about Social Security's November payment schedule and upcoming changes for 2025. We'll continue sharing updates and insights to help you stay informed, supported, and financially secure. Stay tuned as we continue to share updates and support for seniors, bringing you the latest information that could impact your benefits and financial stability. Remember, we're here with you every step of the way.